What's up guys, and today I'm back with another video. Today we're going to be going through the review and results of Fastlane. Almost, the, I literally forgot the pay-per-view. I don't re I guys, even though I just watched it, I don't remember all the matches in order, so I'm sorry if they're not really in order. But I'm going to try. So, in uh, the kickoff show, it was Mustafa Ali versus Matt Riddle. Matt Riddle ended up picking up the victory, but people, I mean, people, uh, they all turned on Mustafa Ali. What I think is going to happen is Reckoning and Slapjack, they're going to make a team or either... They're going to have a storyline where they're, like, dating or something. That's what WWE would do, guys. But um, either that, and then I think those two, T-Bar and that other guy, I forgot his name. I think they're going to form a team. I think Mustafa Ali is going to just be alone. All right, but let's get into the... Okay. And, guys, the reason I say I don't remember is because... I literally got kicked out of the Thunderdome, and my, my sister was watching TV, so I couldn't watch TV. But I know the match is in order, but I just forgot it. So, I, I'll try my best. So, yeah. All right, guys. Then, to start the show off, we had Shayna Baszler. Uh, what is her name? Uh, Nia Jax. I uh, literally forgot Nia Jax's name right there. So we had them versus Sasha Banks and Bianca Belair. So pretty much in this match, really thought Shayna Baszler and Nia Jax, I thought they were going to break up, but they didn't. Uh, Sasha Banks and Bianca Belair at the end, um, she, and she ended up, they ended up turning on each other. And uh, what I'm thinking now is that Sasha Banks is going to turn heel. All right, guys, here. We have um we had Big E versus Apollo Cruz and um it was a big botch at the end. I don't know if Apollo Cruz was supposed to win or I don't know if Biggie was supposed to win, but I know it did not go as planned. I know it was a big botch and it will prob probably be on Botchomania. So, but Biggie retained his title. So, guys, here we go with uh, Shinsuke Nakamura and Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins, and I'm so glad he actually picked up the victory. I'm so glad he picked up the victory. I, and like I said, guys, I'm sorry if these matches are not in order. All right, guys, All right, guys so I don't know where Randy Orton could be right now. Like, literally, I cannot find him anywhere. So, but, to be honest, I don't know who won the match. Like I said, my sister was watching TV, so I couldn't watch it. And um, also, like, I got kicked out of the Thunderdome. But just know, The Fiend came back. All right, guys, so I was in the Thunderdome for this one. This is the match that I got kicked out on. But my friend told me who won. I know there was Claymore kicks. And broad kicks. Well, I don't know about the claimer claimers. But I told you guys that it was gonna be some Kindle sticks. I told you that in my predictions. But Drew McIntyre came on top. My friend told me about this. And yeah, so guys I told you that uh Roman of Rings was gonna win in my predictions. And it was right. I actually got to Oh god, Roman, stand up. So I actually got to see this match. I got to see the ending and the replays. So Jay Uso came and the super kicked uh, Edge, and then there were some chair shots to Edge. Literally, Roman Reigns tapped out, but the ref was not there. So Roman Reigns is still the champ. So, it, it is definitely going to be Roman Reigns versus Edge at WrestleMania. So, thank you guys for watching this uh, review and results. All right, guys. Bye.